Birds of a feather flock together. One of my favorite uh, phrases from my grandparents. And um, I wanted to talk a little bit today about how finding your crowd, finding your tribe, finding people that will help bring you forward and how important that really is. Listen in. Welcome to my journey of self-discovery, life balance, career success, and business creation. This podcast works to answer the question of how successful professionals like us stop drifting and get focused on keeping our careers and businesses growing rapidly while having a full, balanced, and vibrant life that we absolutely love. What we call the Third Power Life. And this is the Third Power Life Podcast. So today I went to the Ocala Crypto Week um, event that uh, they were having at the World Equestrian Center. Um, really cool <laughs> to, to be around people that um, enjoy crypto like I do. And, you know, this um, this evening they, you know, they kind of had their... Uh, they, they call it after party, but really it's everybody kind of getting together in, in a more social setting. And uh, I was having some conversations with, with a couple of different people, um, you know, an artist and, you know, somebody that's really into DeFi and, you know, some other things. And it was just, it was good, neat conversation in an area that I don't have... Um, a whole lot of peers in this area that I that I talk to in about that subject. I, you know, I do have a few friends, but um, it, it's always neat to get around people that have similar interests that you, that you have and have deep knowledge in areas that you don't. Right. Uh, one of my favorite phrases is, "If you're the smartest person in the room in your business, you're in trouble." Right. Um, so. We need to be around people that will help us grow, that will push us, that that know more than we do on whatever subject it is, right? Um, whether it's our business, whether it's our you know personal lives, uh, you know, on how to <laughs> how to do anything, right? Um, but especially when it comes to fulfilling our purpose and our quest and the things that are important you know for this you know crypto for me is a an important piece of the financial part of life balance right um i think it's a, a really important technology i think it's an important investment piece um i just i think it's important for for the future and so for me to be around people that have a far deeper knowledge than I have around, you know, DeFi and NFTs and on and on, right? I mean, I have my my narrow area of expertise. I've been mining, I've been, you know, all of that. But to be around people that are true masters of what they do is a whole different thing. And so my simple message for today is what are the pieces that are important in your life? You know, uh, you know, I use my life balance triad, you know, the nine areas of life balance as a, as a guide, right? You know, spiritual, mental, physical, family, friends, philanthropy, uh, financial education, our income and our expenses, our stuff, those nine areas. And how do you find interesting people for each of those areas in your life and how do you find people that have a depth of knowledge about those areas right you know how do you find somebody who's really has that spiritual connection how do you find somebody who who knows things about subjects that you like better than you do right how how do we deepen our experience around those kinds of things and find those people and incorporate them into your circle, incorporate them into your life, get around them as much as possible. The, you know, the phrase that I always heard growing up is, you know, you will, 
you will earn very similar to the five people that you hang around with most. And that's absolutely true. But here's the other piece of that. You will have a spiritual life very much like the five people that you hang around most. You will have a mental life very much like the five people that you hang around most. Right? It's not just financial. It's all areas of life are influenced by the people that you hang around with. So get around some quality people and be a quality person for someone else. You know, be that for someone. You know, be, basically, you want good people in your life and you need to be a good person so you get to be in other people's lives. You know, you don't want to be the person that brings everybody down, right? If you know what I mean. So, um, so get out there increase your circle, open your friends. You know, I, I'm so, it's so great to be around people that help me grow. You know, Daniel Gray, Woodley Aralis, and, you know, all, all of these people that, that I talked to today. It just, it's really, really awesome. And, you know, I think that everybody needs to do that. So, Get out there, increase your circle with quality people, and this, that's truly how you live your life to the third power. Until tomorrow, my friends. I'm glad you enjoyed this podcast. Please let us know what impacted you in today's episode. You can join our Discord or Facebook community to connect with like-minded people that want a real third power life. You can go to thirdpowerlife.com or look in the show notes for links. And remember, Hit that like, subscribe, and rate button for the Third Power Life podcast. Until next time.